Hi there, this is Steve Snyder, and I'm at the Evergreen Aviation and Space Museum in McMinnville, Oregon. It's an absolutely fantastic museum. You're looking at uh, Howard Hughes' Spruce Goose right now, um, and I'm going to take you on a quick tour of uh, the Warbird section. Uh, to my left here is a Volte Valiant uh, basic trainer, which my dad flew in, in basic. Um, we're going to be coming around here now. I'm going to be moving fairly, fairly fast. Uh, next up is a, a Spitfire, a British Spitfire. Uh, that and the Hurricane are the two primary fighters that the British flew. All these are just in immaculate condition. Uh, next, we're going to come around and uh, see a Messerschmitt uh, 109. Beautiful looking plane. Sorry about the pillar. It's gorgeous. Come back over here. We have a Corsair. Uh, again, another uh, beautiful plane. It's just a magnificent uh, place. They also have a, a space museum here. Here's their B-17, which uh, has been sold to the Collins Foundation. Uh, they're gonna be refurbishing that and uh, bringing it up to flying condition. Over here, we have a uh, Focke Wolf 190, uh, the German fighter that shot down my dad's plane on February 8th, 1944 that the pilot Hans Berger flew, who I interviewed and for my book, Shot Down. And then you have a uh, ME-262, uh, the German uh, fighter jet. It came in at the end of the war. Again, we'll take a uh, look at the, uh, at the iconic B-17 here. Again, with that spruce goose in the background. Another look at the Corsair over here. They have all sorts of different aircraft uh, from different uh, periods of time. Here again, we're looking at the uh, the B-17. Uh, it's a G, you can tell by the chin turret there. Gorgeous plane. There's the, uh, the nose, the Norden bomb site. The uh, Curtis Wright uh, radial engines. Here we have uh, a Mustang P-51. Just, uh, just gorgeous. So come around here. There's, again, they have all sorts of different aircraft here. So that's just a quick, quick peek uh, here at the Evergreen Aviation Museum building. Like I said, they have another uh, space building they have a wonderful 3d theater and then a water park so it's a fabulous place if you ever get up to uh to oregon be sure you come see it